Hi, I'm Nidhi Mathur. I'm the COO and co-founder of Nirame. At Nirame, we are focused on creating a non-contact, non-touch, radiation-free way of detecting breast cancer early using machine learning algorithms. Breast cancer is the most manageable form of cancer. In spite of that, we lose half a million lives every year to breast cancer. And if you look at countries like India, these mortality rates are as high as 50%, right? So we lose one out of every two women who are detected with breast cancer, primarily because we are not able to detect it on time. We at Nirame are focusing on early detection so that we can save those lives by being able to detect early and provide them with quality healthcare. So we are applying artificial intelligent techniques over thermal images. While thermal images have existed for a long time and hardware has consistently been improving with the ability to provide better resolution, higher sensitivity images, what always lacked was the ability to interpret those images that always remain manual and error prone. So with applying the machine learning techniques, we have been able to significantly improve the accuracy with which this technology of thermal imaging can now predict breast cancer in a very reliable way. Medical industry in general, and oncology in particular, it's very difficult to change behaviors of the users. And that has been a biggest challenge because we have come up with something that does things differently from what they have been seeing earlier in their lives. And it has been a challenge to make people understand that there is a new way and there's a better way to do things now and have people accept that. Our work has primarily concentrated in India, but we always believe that the opportunity ahead of us is global in nature. Google Launchpad gave us an opportunity to come out, be in an environment where there are more than 100 mentors who have come from all parts of the world, exposed to different industries. They come with their specific skills in their area. And we got an opportunity to talk to a lot of them in a very short period of time, right? Everybody tells you how to do a customer journey map, how to do a business plan. Nobody tells you how to fail well. Nobody tells you what if you come to a stage where the best option in front of you might be to sell the company, then how would you go about doing that? Nobody tells you about behavioral economics and what are the things that users are thinking that will drive their behavior, which have got nothing to do about your product, right? So how do you build those factors in into your product? I think the, the selection of topics was incredible and things that you usually don't hear from otherwise. We learned a lot about what it would mean for us when we come out of India and actually build a global company. In that sense, it has been an incredible experience learning from so many people in such a short time. We have been uh, continuing to do more work on increasing the medical acceptance. You can see us soon publishing a lot about our work in international tier one peer reviewed journals, as well as we are going to be in a very large number of hospitals offering the services across India. And we are hoping to very soon start uh, our pilot of the other developed markets outside India this year itself.